my name is Yusuf Murad. Okay, uh, I have an um, intelligence uh, background. Uh, um, I didn't have uh, any experience in terms of IT work or cybersecurity. Um, I uh, work on uh, different intelligence uh, uh, disciplines ranging from uh, open source to human extensive work in uh, SIGINT, even in that area. I had uh, some interactions, okay, with the uh, uh, classified databases and tools, okay, a little bit more complicated. Uh, it's in that area, but it's kind of similar to uh, cybersecurity. So um, my story <laughs> started when I started working with uh, uh, Red Team, okay, and the intelligence community, and I was uh, uh, super excited and thrilled to witness uh, uh, one of the bright uh, intel officers uh, working uh, in this field, okay, uh, witnessing uh, the way how they uh, uh, infiltrate uh, different uh, criminal and uh, terrorist uh, organizations and uh, all I'm going to call nerds behind the green screen and you only hear uh, the clicking on the keyboard. It's kind of <laughs> Hollywood uh, style okay, movie scenes. Uh, so um, that experience it just uh, gave me the urge. And I said, uh, since I'm in also, okay, I can understand the components, okay, how that world of, uh, uh, for example, in the Intel analysis, I want to take uh, a challenge, okay, I want to uh, push myself, okay, and uh, uh, take part, okay, of uh, this world, okay. Uh, during that time period, I was like in uh, late uh, 2020, early uh, 2021. I was looking for programs online, okay, and just trying to figure out how to uh, begin um, and start uh, in cybersecurity. Um, in my previous job, okay, I had uh, one friend who has a PhD uh, in uh, artificial intelligence, and I approached him and said, okay, this is what I'm trying to do, and uh, I got uh, two uh, propositions, either to uh, start a career, okay, in uh, artificial intelligence. That has to do a lot of coding. Okay, I found it a little bit challenging and complicated. But the second option was the cybersecurity. And uh, he briefly told me, this is why they do, okay, there are different uh, teams here and there. There's the blue teams who okay, inf involved in more defensive um, area. And there's the red team, okay, those who are in charge of to uh, find out about the vulnerabilities okay, of their companies okay, or adversaries uh, group worldwide. So, um, and that, during that time, okay, I met a few friends, okay, who live here in North Virginia, okay, and was advised to uh, start uh, classes, okay, with this uh, uh, company, okay, slash a school called uh, CyberNow Labs in uh, Sterling, uh, Virginia. I did some research, okay, and um, I found one uh, privilege and something that other uh, schools or companies don't have uh, with the CyberNow Labs, okay they not only work with through okay to earn your uh, first step of uh, um, to earn your uh, security plus but also they have a cutting edge technology in terms of uh, edrs and sims tools and that is a critical component for you to get a job okay as entry level sec analyst so that was my story okay, how i get involved okay in cyber uh, security um four uh, months okay uh, into the training and everything okay it took me about um i would say five six weeks of uh job hunting okay till i land my first job okay and as um, sir uh, richard chapman okay, just mentioned earlier okay we walk you through okay this process okay it's give you the confidence it gives you the knowledge okay all the tools uh, needed okay to uh, go to the interview fully uh, armed okay with knowledge when uh, you know, okay, uh, what you're doing, okay, and use the appropriate uh, terminology and, uh, and the lingo, okay, in the field, okay, you give the impression, okay, to your recruiter that you know what to do. You already worked on a ticketing system. You, you, you know how to deal, okay, and interact with different teams, okay, and the community you knows how to uh, write, file a report, okay, interact with engineers and this and that. And that's briefly okay, my story. <laughs> well, my it's, it's a great story. Yeah, for Thank first you time so you much. <laughs> I know, right? Well, it's funny. We, we've talked on the phone. We've been on calls together. We've never actually physically met in person, which is awesome. It's nice to meet you in person for the first time. So thank you very much for being here.